You read the title correctly. Alex Belfield has given me an idea. An idea for this channel. But before I get started, let's just be clear. Alex Belfield didn't ring me up and say, hey, this is what you should do. And I didn't ring up Alex Belfield and say, what should I do? Do you have any ideas? He's given me this idea because Alex Belfield has sought to go off platform. Now, I'm not proposing to go off platform, but the idea and with what he's done has given me an idea for what to do with my channel here on platform and sort of in conjunction with my website. So let's get to it. So many of you in the comments have said about my live streams, which I was holding on Sundays every single week. Now, many of you will have wondered what happened to those live streams. Well, as it happened, and I mentioned on many of those live streams, my channel lost subscribers almost every single live stream that I did even though I would sit for maybe an hour, an hour and a half, two hours, three hours, and spend a lot of time, a lot of effort and energy, which I really enjoyed, by the way. I really enjoyed doing that and answering your questions on the fly by way of guidance and interaction. It was actually one of the most enjoyable aspects of creating this channel. However, I did realize twofold. First of all, that it was losing subscribers on a weekly basis solely because of the live stream. My channel would lose subscribers during the live stream, after the live stream, whilst people were watching or going to that live stream video and unsubscribing because they didn't want to watch live streams. Now, cancel culture, you might scream, but that's the fact of the matter. But not only that, there was a secondary effect that it had on my channel, which I realized that because the retention rate and the average view duration and all the technical stuff that we as creators have to get to grips with with our channels, Side note, that's why some of my videos are a little bit clickbaity, title and thumbnail, because more people watch them than if I do a very descript title, but I digress. But because of the very low retention rate on the live streams and relatively low click through rate and all combined very poor statistics as far as YouTube's concerned, I don't feel that YouTube, the platform, has sufficiently segregated the live streams and the rest of the channel, the rest of the content. Now, I understand that there is a segregation in the way that YouTube looks at live streams as against normal videos and shorts even. But however much YouTube has separated those types of content, I don't feel, in fact, the statistics prove to me, for anyone that's interested who wants to create a YouTube channel, the statistics have proven to me conclusively, I'm afraid, that doing those live streams harmed my channel. It harmed the channel by way of the following few days, views would be lower. Certainly the views and subscriber rates for the next few days would be lower for particularly the live stream video, but also videos that I did on and around that day. So as a result, I decided actually over Christmas by way of convenience, I decided to experiment not doing live streams over that period of time. And the views increased exponentially over that Christmas period throughout December, January, and in combination with other sort of strategies by which I was using shorter videos, punchy videos, newsworthy updates, legal updates, answering your question type videos, all of those seem to be vastly more popular and certainly the effects, the negative effects from the live streams seem to disappear. So as yet, I haven't gone back to those live streams and I feel that those negative effects have somewhat disappeared, albeit obvious effects such as the war going on right now have an effect on all YouTube channels and views are down for lots of different channels across the board. I feel that those live streams did have a negative effect. So why am I telling you all this and what is the idea? I hear you scream at the screen. So here it is. My idea is this. Many of you have supported me for quite some time and still support me on this channel by subscribing to this channel, not just as a subscriber, but as a paying member of this channel. Now those memberships at the moment make your comments stand out more than any others because I can filter them in the back end and see members' comments first. And so those comments and suggestions very often find their way into new videos, certainly more than other ideas and random ideas, and they inform the content generally going forward. My idea, therefore, is that live streams and a particular community, a private community, a secret community, if you will, for all members and all future members, whereby I will 
do live streams either on a regular basis or a random basis or different times to suit different people in different shifts and things like that for a much smaller but select group of exclusive members only. You might have noticed that the live streams are already member only because I've switched them from public view to member only. So all of those will still be included and there was at least, I think, 35 weeks worth of live stream content that you can go back and watch as a member of this channel. And if this works well, then all future live streams will be members only. And I can have a much more informal me to you as a member type content whereby if you join as a member, I will directly respond to your questions. It can't be legal advice, of course not, because I'm not sitting down in full conference with you and you're not instructing me to give you advice and there's no contract. But nonetheless, I found, especially recently, answering your questions has not only been really helpful to you guys, but also fun for me to do, but also it is time consuming. Now, obviously I spend a lot of time and energy squeezing these videos into what is otherwise a very, very busy day. In fact, some days have been 15, 18 hour days. And even in the 15 minutes that I get some time, rather than eat something or go outside for a straw. I reach for my phone and I try to answer some of these questions and slap these up as videos for you. You've probably seen me in different buildings, in shirts and ties and pushing these videos out wherever I can. So there's my idea. You can see a join button on every video and on my channel homepage and my channel about page. And there are various levels of membership there, student, consumer, business and law student. Now the law student member at the moment also gives you full access to black belt barrister com where I am gradually building a course to support those that want to really study law or just understand more about civil procedures to bring your own claims in court and that kind of thing. But as time goes on, I will probably consolidate all of those memberships into one simple pricing strategy, which will give you even more exclusive content for everybody, depending on the numbers. And of course, the more of you that join as a member to this channel, the more I can grow it because the more I can spend time developing this content exclusively for channel members so I very much hope to see you on the inside so thanks for watching and please do check out the memberships and we'll see where this goes